Hi, I'm Weston. I love talking about the Astros, and I'm here to recap Game 119 of the regular season. Astros lose 7-6 to the Kansas City Royals in a game that I really wish I was more shocked that we lost, if I'm being completely honest with you. The Astros just have this nasty little habit this season of playing down and losing to vastly inferior opponents and would you looky there they did it again the royals win a back and forth game uh where the astros it's sort of a game where you go uh shucks that one that's a bummer the astros weren't terrible uh they did some things well tonight but there was just too much working against them uh overall this is a very back-and-forth game. The Astros would take a lead or tie, and the Royals would pull ahead. It was a very entertaining game from the outset, if you aren't an Astros fan, where it was just... meh. So, scoring. In the first, Jordan Alvarez singles, puts the Astros up one nothing immediately. Great. That's awesome. Uh, then the Royals, in the second, would strike... And they would score a pair. And then in the third, they'd get another one. Uh, they'd take a 3-1 lead after the third inning. And at that point, you're going, okay, this is a bit rough for the Astros. Then the Astros, here they come. Knock, knock. They're storming back. Diaz homers. Great. Uh, a little bit later on, Michael Brantley with an RBI single. He didn't have a multi-hit night, but Brantley had a hit tonight. Great. That's good. Uh, in the sixth, Correa homers. Great. The Astros take a 4-3 lead. Cool. Then in the bottom half of the sixth, Hunter Dozier. Homers. It's tied at four. Then in the seventh, the Royals retake the lead. Single by Carlos Santana makes it 5-4. to four. Then the next inning, uh, Diaz, RBI single, makes it five apiece. Good. Cool. Neat. Bottom of the eighth, Royals get a pair on a Salvador Perez RBI single. Uh, which makes it a 7-5 game. Castro homers in the ninth. Makes it 7-6. Star tries to make a comeback. The Astros fall short. And this is a game where I I said it already. A little bit of everything is working against us. Um, now the offense on the outset looks okay, right? You see six runs and you're like, well, I, that's going to win some games. Three for nine risks. You had a lot of opportunities that you just weren't able to cash in on. It felt like the Astros had a ton of foot traffic that they just weren't really able to bring home. At least that's, again, that's what it sort of felt like to me. There were opportunities that we couldn't cash in on. The starting pitching was okay. It wasn't great by Jacob Rizzi. Five and a third, four runs given up. And I know that you might say, Weston, that is not a good game by Jacob Rizzi. And I would agree it's not. But by a fourth guy in the rotation fourth or fifth that's fine that's okay that's acceptable and it just wasn't enough to get the win the bullpen also struggled uh Stennett gave up a run he struggled a lot but at least he only kept it to one and Yumi Garcia gave up a pair in the eighth it was a, Phil Maton was good so that's a positive you got to strike out in his er, his two-thirds so that's that's good it's just one of those games where I wish I could say I was more shocked, but I'm I'm just not. The Astros just cannot win against bad teams. I don't know what it is. The Royals, this should have been a dunk on game. And instead the Royals get a win. It ah uh, it just it just kinda sucks. You know, we there are good spots offensively. There are positives. Altuve had a three-hit night, so that's great to see. Especially since he was kind of slumping against the uh, Angels. I believe he was 0 for 5 and 0 for 4 in back-to-back -back games, so that's a positive that he had a three-hit night. Correa had a multi-hit game, including a home run. That's good. Jordan had an RBI single. That's good. You know, uh, Diaz had a multi-hit game. That's great. Ludmus Diaz, I've said it a few times, having a very underrated season this season. The Astros just... It's a game where you weren't necessarily terrible, and I've used this once before. You weren't terrible, but you were the second best team on the field. 
and that's really all you can take from it. The offense did kind of show up. The pitching staff just wasn't there, and the situational hitting also kind of wasn't there. You just got to pick yourselves up, move on to tomorrow, and luckily for the Astros, you have one of your better pitchers going from Rivaldez tomorrow. Uh, we'll pitch 3.09 ERA rolling in. They send out Daniel Lynch, who rolls in with a 5.97 Astros. Please. You, you got another situation where you can easily win. That, again, starts at 8.10, 7.10 Central. I'll be here after that. Sorry about today's video delay, by the way. Uh, I do apologize. Uh, I will do my very best to not let that happen again. And that's it. It's just one of those ah shucks, shake your fist in the air, we'll get them next time games. I'll be here tomorrow. So thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you all have an absolutely fantastic day. And as always, Ghost Rose.